Hey heroes, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, The Oracle Seasons, with me, Voltage Make Hammer. What's cool about this screen that we're on right now? It has an aspect of every season. Not that you're going to use them all. First, we use summer. Once you have summer, you can climb up those vines, climb out these vines. And you see that statue? We're gonna push it. Then we're just gonna go away, because the stairs don't come all the way down. Don't bother killing these armors if you can. I mean, they just... They come back as soon as you just leave one screen. Now it needs to be winter. Alright. With that done, there's now a snowdrift here. That would have kept you from pushing that statue before. But now there's that snowdrift that we can climb up on. Just push these statues. I don't think this one pushes. No, it doesn't. Alright. Now we just need to change it to autumn. Get out my sword and the power bracelet. Because I can. And he's gonna get me. Yes, he is. Come on, let me look. Ah, come on. Fine, you wanna die? I'll kill you. Also, I think there's always gonna be a heart under. Yeah, I think there is. There's always a heart underneath of a mushroom. Alright. Switch this over. As a reindeer, in return, I offer my advice. If you are lost in the woods, travel west, then south, then east, then north, taking each step in a warmer season. Which makes me wonder, how are you supposed to do that unless you have the Staff of Seasons? What? Uh, oh no. Okay, I got through that without- Ah! I had to jinx myself. Alright. There's gotta be some more mushrooms a little bit later, so I don't need to fully heal up. Here we go! This is why it needs to be autumn! Don't necessarily need to change it, like, right there. Alright, like likes. I'm at full health, so I'm not gonna show the inside of this cave. I am gonna bomb it open. What's in there? A fairy. That's what's in there. You got, like, a fairy that heals you all the way. Alright, what do I do with this? How about fire? Yeah! Do -de -de -d? It's staring at your phonograph. Play it. D, what a dune! I love it! I'll teach you away to my secret spot! If temperatures rise and you go far to the west, you'll find it! Only instance in the trading game where you don't actually trade anything. However, you do have to trigger that talk in order to. Ah! Ah, like likes! No, they keep on spawning. You can never kill them all. Anyway. This is the Lost Woods kind of segment. You can't proceed to the west or north of here unless you do the things. In order to do this, I believe you have to make it winter, then autumn, then spring, then summer. I'm going to go in to the west first. So that we can get that trading sequence done. Even though we didn't actually trade anything. By going further to the west summer now. Ah, I switched it too soon. Ah, well. Easy enough to fix. Just takes a while. Hooray! You got the Sacred Noble Sword! Awesome! And just like the Noble Sword in the other game, it shoots out beams of light. Alright, now how'd it go? West, south, east, north? Yeah, I think it was west, south, east, north. And yeah, like likes will continue to come from the bottom of the screen, even if you are supposed to go to the south. So be careful, you need to keep your shield. And how many times do I hit it over? Yeah, this. This is working, I believe. Here's something I didn't mess up. Awesome! Also, these will come to life, so don't aggravate them if you can help it. Hooray! We can now teleport here whenever we want. Ah, that guy is no good. Uh, I'm going to try and jump up. Nope, hit him. Eh, uh, where's my rod? Oh, I have it in hand! Hooray! I'm gonna make it autumn first so I can go to the west and get whatever it is underneath that burnable tree. Like this. Oh hey! It's 
a Gasha seed. Alright, that's fine. I'll go with that. Do you have a heart? No. Okay, so there's not always a heart gonna be under one of the trees. And I'm gonna take damage here. Hooray! Alright, now it's winter. You need it to be winter to proceed. Ah! Leave the shovel to proceed. Where's my shovel? Alright! There we go. Got a bomb. Behold, snowdrift. There's just a wall here. You don't have it be winter. There we go. Now we can proceed. Oh, don't worry about these trees. It's just some guy that'll take your money. And here's why it needs to be winter. Now we just need to change it back over to spring. Like so. And let this propel us back up. Alright. Boom. Already traveled through the area where you need all four seasons. Now for level 6, the Ancient Ruins! I don't remember this place. I, this is my most memorable place out of the whole of the season's dungeons. Yet, I don't remember anything in here other than one puzzle. Alright, where are all these snakes? There they are. Well, that's some of them. Okay. You need to go this way first in order to propel that, uh... thing. Don't try to slash at this. That ground will cave through. And don't worry about this treasure chest so much. It's just five rupees. More snakes. Alright, is it here? Yeah, it's there. Yes. Yes! Aha! Rupee room! Kinda hidden rupee room that you have to check the wall in order to find. Or you need to check a guy like this. I found that my first playthrough and I was like, yeah, money! Because surely there can't just be one in the game, you know? Don't need to kill anything in this room. Nothing happens or changes if you kill anything. Now why did I go through all that? Sad this will not turn this way! Yeah, I know, not that exciting. What's up here? Little puzzle. But there's an easy way to do this puzzle. First, I'm gonna get rid of this... whatever it's called. Whisper or something. But now that I pushed out that wall, it's a lot easier to do this puzzle. What you're supposed to do is... pull and push this ball all the way around over there and do all sorts of craziness. There we go. Hooray for off-screening things! Now, will you just go on down here? Uh, yeah, you'll have to kill all these things eventually. Actually, multiple times, I believe. I'm gonna take a quick route up here and get whatever it is up here. In this chest. The dungeon map! Ooh. Yeah, well, it doesn't take that much extra effort to get this once all the enemies are dead, and this is open. Now, the point of going here is not to trap yourself forever. We now have created an effective loop that we can abuse. All we need to do is move this ball onto this switch, and now we can flip this thing wherever we need to go. We need to go... Uh, it's faster to take this route, yeah. We need to go the other way. So we're going to walk in a couple of circles this way. You can kill the things in here, but I don't really find that much purpose in it. It's not like they drop a key. Now we just walk back around there and we can go to a new area. And yes, you're going to hear that ring every time you enter that room. Because hey, you open the door with the block that's already on the block. With the switch. Hooray! Or magnet puzzle. Alright, next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Oracle of Seasons, I'm going to do this jumping th trick thing. Later, heroes!